bienvenidos a Todo el Mundo. Soy Chris, profesor nativo de Manchester, Inglaterra, y estás escuchando Inglés Diario, una forma gratuita de aprender inglés en un tiempo récord. Durante el podcast que vais a escuchar, dejamos unas pausas precedidas por un... Así que cuando escuches el... Pausa el audio e inténtalo tú. Let's start the class. Okay, so okay. the most difficult part of the class. This is um, tercera condicional. Uh -huh. And it's very, very difficult. Tenemos primera condicional, segunda condicional y tercera condicional. Y utilizamos right. en inglés condicionales. ¿Cómo utilizamos condicionales <coughs> en español? En español tenemos condicionales. Would como, you like... Oh. Yeah, como, por ejemplo, si compro el billete... Podré ganar la lotería. Yeah, if I buy the ticket, yeah. I will yeah. won. I could, I, I could, could win the lottery. I could win the lottery. Yeah. Yeah. So <clears throat> it's kind of not um, real. It's things that we Yo imagine. podría ganar, ¿no? O sea, yeah. I oh, will be beat. Yeah, se llama condicional. Es yeah. condicional porque no es real. Es algo que puede pasar. Ok, y tenemos varias, varios grados de condicional. Yeah. <laughs> condicional tercero es el que <coughs> si no existe. Ok, primero. Yeah. Lo habría hecho si estuviera allí. I... If... No. I was done if I uh, if I was here no if I were here no Look. no where is plural yeah if I uh, I have done if I was there close close I would have mm -hmm. I would have done it lo habría hecho I, I would, would have, have done it. So if that means I so, will have done it. Yeah. If yeah. So that means that abria is yeah. would have. Yeah. Okay. Abria would have. Y si escuchas la palabra abria, la traducción siempre es would have. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Entonces lo abria <coughs> hecho. I would have done it. Correct. Lo habría hecho. Oh, porque I would have eso done es, it. No, done it lo hemos visto antes también. Yeah, done. Done. Yeah. Was done. Yeah. Está hecho. It's done. It's done. Okay. Yeah. Um, I would have done it. I would have done it. I, I would have done it. I would have done it. Eso es tercera condicional porque uh, I would have done it significa que no está hecho. No lo he hecho, pero lo habría hecho. Yeah. <laughs> pero ya ha pasado el momento. Y no. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And you can say, it, uh, it, is it, it isn't done. It isn't done. Yo, no, no está, está hecho. hecho. No está Not hecho. for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, lo habría hecho, pero no está hecho. It, uh, I would have done it Good. but is it done no it isn't done yes it isn't done sorry repeat it lo habría hecho pero he dicho lo habría hecho pero está hecho <coughs> yeah <laughs> <laughs> that is muy condicional <laughs> I would I would have done it but it isn't done very good ok algo eh, que a veces es eh, positivo para decir las cosas bien es decirlas lentas es como yeah. alargar las frases no I was made a... no te extiendes y te da tiempo para pensar eso, y decirlo eso. correctamente sí, sí. Digo a mis estudiantes, cuando hago un inglés sí. yo hago a veces eso para poder decir correctamente porque yeah, necesito yeah, pensar yeah. al mismo I... tiempo que sabes no me sale del alma hay dos palabras interesantes uno es cause y el otro es so. So oh. es un diminutivo de because. Ajá. Uh -huh. Cause. Y, yeah. How do you write? 
and internet and WhatsApp. <laughs> What's <C-O-S-S. laughs> <C-O-S-S. laughs> Sure. <laughs> Feo ese. And it's correct. Está bien. <laughs> es the same that because. Yeah, ¿por qué? Because. Because. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> y siempre digo, si, si necesitas tiempo. Because. Because. Cause es una buena palabra. Like, because. Está, it's like, because. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same that so. No? So, yo digo so. Y lo so. has escuchado muchas veces en las clases. No? So much. Digo, so. <laughs> Sabes, y esta es la palabra que uso para pensar. Because, because or so. Yeah. Y con tercera condicional, son buenas palabras porque hay que pensar mucho yeah. en esto, ¿vale? Yeah. Ok, so. ¿Cómo se dice? <laughs> lo habría hecho otra vez. Lo habría hecho. I would done it. No, no. I will have. I will have. Yep. I will have done it. Perfect. Lo habría hecho. ¿Cómo se dice? <coughs> Hubiéramos volado. Hubiéramos nosotros. Eh, we will have. Yep. Fly it. Interesting. Uh, flown. Flown. Oh, es, es horrible este participio. Flown. Partidio. Es fly. Yeah. Pasado es flu. Flu. F-L-E-W. Flu. 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 Flown. 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 F-L-O-W-N. Yeah. Flown. Yeah. Hemos I, volado. We have. We have flown. Yeah. 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 Uh, Hubiéramos volado. Eh, hubiéramos volado es we eh, we would have flown very good um, te habría pagado <risa> eh, te habría pagado ay Would have paid quién you correct otra vez I would have paid you pero no tuve suficiente dinero suficiente pasta <laughs> which is the normal I <laughs> would have paid you but we haven't enough money Interesting, very good, very good. We didn't have, we didn't we have. We didn't have, yeah. We haven't, no. We hadn't, no. We hadn't, uh, hadn't es un auxiliar y no significa yeah. no tuvimos. Uh, but di- we didn't have money, is the same, no? No tenía suficiente. dinero o no tenía suficiente dinero. Uh, en inglés, he puesto suficiente porque siempre no diríamos pasta. suficiente. Yeah. En inglés, siempre diríamos suficiente. Nunca, we no dirías, we didn't have money. No tenía no, dinero. No, eso suena f- mal en inglés. Uh, siempre yeah. sería, we didn't have money. Yeah, enough. we didn't have money is like you are in the sleeping street, ¿no? Yeah, okay. yeah, true, 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 true. clavo, en plan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. En, en plan... Yeah. And enough money is, I have money, but not enough. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Ese día. <laughs> Ese día. <laughs> Y ahora tampoco. <risa> <risa> ok. Ah, es una vez más. A coincidence. Um, te habría pagado, pero no tuve suficiente dinero. Uh, I would have paid you, but we didn't have enough money. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Very good. Ok. Negativo. Ok, habría es would have. Lo habría hecho es I would have done it. Now, negativo sería I would. I would have done it. Negativo sería I would. Correct. I would have. Ok, done. y la T se empuja I en wouldn't. el have. So it goes I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have. So I wouldn't difficult. have. Bueno. <laughs> I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have. Yeah, perfect. It's like the disappear. Yeah, kind have, of. No? Yeah. It... I wouldn't have is I wouldn't have. Yeah. I wouldn't have. It's like 
I've, no? I've. I've, yeah, correct. <coughs> Apostrophe, I've, I've. I've. ¿Por qué son auxiliares? ¿Y por qué utilizamos estos yeah. auxiliares día en día, todos los días, mil veces? Yeah. Lo sentimos suave, suavemente y, y no pronunciamos o no... Um, ¿Qué quiero decir? No, no vocalizamos mucho. Vocalizamos. Ok. ¿Ready? Okay, yes. No lo habría visto. I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't have. No. I wouldn't. No, wouldn't have. Wouldn't, wouldn't have. have. See, okay. tranquilo. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't have. Eh, no lo habría visto. I wouldn't have eh, visto sin it. Perfect. Well done. I'm very happy. Yeah. No lo habría bebido. I wouldn't uh, have drunk it. Yeah, si supiera que fuese whisky. <laughs> I, I wouldn't have drunk it if I... No. If I know, if I participio de no is, uh, if no, de saber no, mm. if I new, 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 yeah, pronunciación es igual, es igual que nuevo, yeah, como se dice new, new, yeah, new, new, yeah, podemos repetir, no es yeah. I wouldn't have drunk it. If I eh, knew that is not that was whiskey, very good. That it was whiskey. That it was whiskey. Yeah. Okay. I wouldn't have drunk it if I knew that it was whiskey. <laughs> I I wouldn't have drunk it if I knew if it was whiskey. That it was whiskey. That. If that, yeah. If that is whiskey. No, has dicho, has dicho if, pero no es if, es that. That is whiskey. Yeah. So I wouldn't have drunk it if I knew that is it was that it was yeah that it was whiskey. I wouldn't drunk it. No. No. I wouldn't have drunk it. If I knew that it was has oh whiskey. <laughs> no, yeah, no. That it was whiskey. Ah oh, fuck <laughs> <laughs> So difficult. Uh, muy bien, muy bien. No, estás haciendo muy bien aquí. Um I wouldn't have drunk it if I knew that it was whiskey. Esto la verdad está mal. Y yeah. van a escuchar mucha gente al podcast y me, me van a decir Chris, eso está mal, tío. Porque sí, debe por decir, debe decir, I wouldn't have drunk it if I had known that it was whiskey. If I had known that it was whiskey. If I have known. If I had known. Yeah. Que es el pasado perfecto que significa que ya lo he bebido. If I had known antes de beberlo, I wouldn't have drunk it. And it I means wouldn't that have drunk it. ¿Lo has bebido o no? Yeah. Lo has bebido. <clears throat> pero no lo habrí, hubieras bebido si yeah. hubiera, si supieras. I que. wouldn't have drunk it if I knew yeah, that it was whiskey. Yes. Yeah, yeah. O sea, no lo habría bebido si yo... Si supiera si que... Supiera que era whisky. Que era whisky, sí, sí, sí. Yeah. Interesting stuff. But give me more. Yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> ¿Hubiera llegado tarde? <clears throat> Ahí 
No, hubiera llegado tarde, interrogante. No, 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 uh, interrogante no. Ah, I would have arrived later. Late. Late. Yeah. Más tarde, later. More late. Luego, later, más tarde, later. Late. Okay. Uh, tarde. Yeah. Is late. late. Hubiera llegado tarde, pero no había tráfico. I will uh, have arrived later. No. Hubiera llegado tarde. Late. Yeah. Más I tarde. Will... Yeah, más tarde es later. Luego. Luego late. No, later. Tarde. Late. Yeah. Más tarde o luego, ¿no? Yeah. I will. Uh, I will have arrived. Late, lo que era es si no hubiera tenido coche. No, pero no había <coughs> tráfico. Uh, I would have late, but uh, it wasn't traffic. No, ¿cómo se dice hay tráfico? There are traffic, no. <laughs> sí, más o menos sí, pero has dicho there are. There are. De, 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 ah, de hay is. tráfico, claro, porque te refieres a que. A ellos, a los coches, a ellos. Yeah, there are traffic. No, no, no. There is traffic. There is traffic. There is traffic. Ah. Traffic es singular. Es yeah, contable. yeah. Um, there isn't traffic. There isn't traffic. No hay tráfico. There isn't traffic. Había tráfico. There was traffic. There was traffic. No había tráfico. There isn't traffic. No. There... No había tráfico. Mm -hmm. There... No. There wasn't traffic. Perfect. Excellent. Uh, y en inglés siempre pondríamos un any ahí. There wasn't any traffic. Yeah. There wasn't any traffic. Good. Hubiera llegado tarde, pero no había tráfico. I would arrive. No. I would have. <laughs> I would have. I would have arrived late, but. Eh, de, but, no, otra vez lo olvido. Mm. <laughs> eh, there wasn't any traffic. Excellent. I would have arrived late, but eh, it wasn't any traffic. There, there wasn't. There. Yeah. There wasn't. There wasn't. Yeah. Okay. But there wasn't any traffic. <clears throat> vale. Yo que tú. Yo que tú, yo que tú. Yo que tú. You say that in yeah. Spanish. Sí, sí. Like, if I were you. Perfect. Exactly. <laughs> ¿Cómo sabes eso? For, uh, I have a... Uh, I, I remember a song. Ah, sí. ¿Y cómo I se dice you. yo que tú? No. Never let me down if I were you. <laughs> really? <laughs> Guay. Um, yo que tú no habría... No lo habría hecho así. If I were you, I. If I were you, I don't. No, no lo habría. Don't. Hecho. Wouldn't. If I were you, I wouldn't have done it. Yes. <laughs> good, good, good. Perfect. Very good. Esa es buena. Interesting. Typical. Yeah, we, we tenemos dos cláusulas. Es la palabra gramática de, de esto cláusula y tenemos dos <coughs> tenemos uh, no lo habría hecho <coughs> si yo fuera tú o si yo fuera tú sí. no lo habría hecho if I were you I would have I wouldn't have done it yeah and the or, other side yeah is I wouldn't have done it if I were yeah, you yeah I wouldn't have done it if I were you Or if I were you, I wouldn't have done if it. If I were you, I would have done it. Perfect. Very good pronunciation. I prefer if I were you but first. It doesn't really make any difference yeah. at all. It's just so that you know that sometimes yeah. you hear it this way and sometimes you hear it this way. But yeah. both are the same. So, um, hubiera llegado tarde, pero no, no es, como había un con, es como un consejo, ¿no? Yeah, sí. O echar en cara también. ¿Qué? Lo de yo que tú. If I were you... Puede ser un, una amenaza a veces. Claro, o sea, amenaza <risa> puede tú? ser consejo. It depends on the tone. Yeah, yeah. Depends on the tone. tone. The tone. Yeah, tone of voice. 
Aquí termina el podcast de hoy. Yo soy Chris y ha sido un placer ayudarte. Recuerda que Inglés Diario a través de Export puede ayudar a tu empresa. Si tienes una web o necesitas contenidos, traducciones o clases personalizadas para tu negocio en inglés, no dudes en contactar con nosotros a través de Inglés Diario o visitando la web en www.x-port.es x p o r -t punto es. La música de este episodio fue arreglada por Chad Crouch, conocido como Poddington Bear. Puedes ver su música en www.poddingtonbear.com Y la música de intro de Mr. Juan en www.juanitos.net Y gracias a todos los alumnos que nos ceden su tiempo para crear este recurso. Si quieres ver la transcripción, están colgados en el blog en www.inglesdiario.es. Gracias a Will92 por todos sus esfuerzos. See you next time.